Kirk J. Team Blake. You made it. Yeah, Bateman, that's Kirk J. is now a finalist on The Voice. He was the first member of the Final Four announced tonight, moving him one step closer to his dream. NBC 15's Corey Pippen is live in Kirk's hometown of Bay Manette, where his fans and family have been cheering him along every step of the way. Corey. Greg Kim, Kirk J. supporters are thrilled he made it to the Final Four. Now they're hoping he can head to the finale and win it all. Kirk J. Team Blake, you made it. Baldwin County's rising star continues to climb his way to the top in front of the entire country. Tonight, Kirk J again survived elimination, advancing to the final four on The Voice. All to cheers from his biggest supporters, watching from a restaurant in his hometown of Hermanette. One of the happiest people in the room is Kirk's own dad, Robert Franklin. When he called him first, I said, go ahead, son. You got it. Yeah. In, it in it to win it. Franklin says he always knew his son had it in him. As a little child growing up, I mean, we were, you love know, entertaining folks, so this is his calling. A calling which Kirk referenced on The Voice moments before making it to the next round. I feel like I'm um, one step closer to, you know, all my dreams coming true. And uh, country music is, is my life, and I want to showcase that going into the finale. The Babinette community has rallied behind Kirk every week, with friends, family, and even strangers coming together for his performances and possible elimination. To see Kirk and his talent, this is phenomenal for us. He's always been a special kid, always had this gift. We just never knew that it would be this big. So we're, we're going to go all the way, and I just have faith that he's going to bring it back to Baymanette. Kirk J will take the stage once again for final performances next Monday with the two-hour finale on Tuesday. Reporting live in Baymanette, I'm Corey Pippen, NBC 15.